The CGI of D.Y. Chandrachur has made a big statement on the arbitrary arrest and bulldozer action during an event organized by the Supreme Court Bar Association. The CGI emphasized that justice must reach the last person in line. He added that those facing arbitrary arrests and demolitions must find voice in the court. The CGI highlighted the need for an overhaul of the judicial infrastructure in the country to make courts accessible to everyone. Irrespective of an outcome of the case, I believe the real strength of our system is granting access to justice to our citizens. That sense of confidence of the individual that an arbitrary arrest, a threatened demolition, may be a pension which is attached unlawfully, must find a solace and voice in the judges of the Supreme Court. As I look to the future, I believe the greatest challenge before the Indian judiciary is to eliminate the barriers to accessing justice. We have to enhance access to justice procedurally by eliminating the constraints which prevent citizens from approaching courts and substantively by building confidence in the court's ability to dispense justice. And we have a roadmap in place to make sure that the future Indian judiciary is inclusive and accessible to the last person in the line. The law minister was speaking to me just the other day and he said that we celebrate in 2023, 100 years after Dr. Ambedkar first stepped foot in the fertile soil of our court premises. And he suggested to me, why don't we now have an event to mark the evolution of what Dr. Ambedkar was then 100 years ago and what his successors today, the young lawyers, the young professionals are in our society. To make our courts accessible and inclusive, we need to overhaul our court infrastructure on a priority basis. Our emphasis on modernizing the judicial infrastructure to meet the challenges of the future is key to this mission. Very significant statement coming in from the Chief Justice of India, Deva Chandrachud. Uh, he was speaking at an event hosted by uh, Supreme Court Bar Association in connection with the Independence Day celebration at the Supreme Court launch. And why, do, uh, why it is important is because all these were remarks were made in the presence of the law minister, uh, Arjun Ram uh, Meghwal. Uh, so this adds to the uh, comments he made. Uh, he said uh, that uh, he spoke against arbitrary arrest and the uh, uh, unlawful and illegal demolition, saying harried uh, citizens must find solace in the voice of judges of the Supreme Court. Uh, in fact, he, it, this is what exactly he said. The sense of confidence in an individual that an arbitrary arrest, a threatened demolition, if the properties are attached unlawfully, must find solace and a voice in the judges of the Supreme Court. Uh, in fact, uh, uh, the Chief Justice um, uh, he also said that uh, in the past uh, 76 years suggested that the history of Indian judiciary is the history of struggle of daily common man. And he said, I believe the challenge of the judiciary is to eliminate barriers of access to justice and have a roadmap in place to ensure the justice is accessible and inclusive to the last person in line, as you rightly said. Uh, so, uh, in fact, these uh, comments I think significant in view of... Uh, uh, several uh, acts of uh, uh, bulldozer justice being meted out to, and the, the petitions filing up across high courts and Supreme Court in the country complaining against it and also illegal arrest, uh, the alleged illegal arrest complained against uh, the ED and the uh, CBI in various corruption cases. Back to you.